Hey, what's up, you guys? Mr. Editor316. I'm back on YouTube. I'm here to make two DVD, two DVD reviews. Um, from what you call it? The scroll was nice, and I rocked Noid91. All right. Uh, they both requested me to make a DVD review. Uh, one for each. So I decided to make it on one video because I have a lot of DVDs re to review. So I can only review one today. So I decided to do two right now. All right. At the same time. So let's get to it. Um, let's start off with Scroll is nice. Okay, his link will be in the description box. His DVD request was the Definitive Collection Ric Flair. Now, uh, I believe I made a review on this. Maybe I deleted it, but um, yeah. Anyways, this DVD was outstanding. Um, just a, just a, let's just say it's a DVD to talk about an outstanding man. Um, I mean, they made like many Ric Flair DVDs they made two actually um, the the de uh, the definitive collection and the ultimate collection and uh, this is the newer version uh, after he retired from the WWE um, if you open up the disc I mean if you open up the package it says right here to beat the man uh, to be the man you got to beat the man I actually like that phrase um, very much and it shows some of great footage in his career, in his legacy, um, especially with his great matches with Ricky the Dragon Steamboat, Shawn Michaels at WrestleMania 24. Um, I believe that's supposed to be Roddy Piper. I can't tell. I think so. And Triple H from the Cage match, and that's Ric Flair with the NWA title, and more. Uh, if you open it up, you got those stylized discs. But um, anyways, if you um, there's a slip. Um, on the first disc, it talks about some of the things that has happened in his life or his experiences, um, especially the plane crash back in '78, I believe, either '78 or '95, one of those. Two. Anyways, uh, it also talks about him in WCW, WWE. And much more. It also talks about his the four horsemen career and have on that with Barry Windham, you know, Tully Blanchard, uh, Arn Anderson, even Chris Benoit, um, who was a newcomer at the time. Anyways, uh, it also talks. Yeah, it also has some stories like him buying boots, two main distractions, bleaching his hair, hanging with the outlaws. Uh, his relationship with the members of Evolution and Key to the City. So a lot of good stuff. Uh, and they also show his tribute video. Um, they have some good matches as well. Like um, his match with Harley, Harley Race for the NWA title. Um, his match with Sting in the, early day, in the early days. Like back in the 80s. Not in the 90s. Like back in the 80s. Uh, his match with Terry Funk for the world title. Roddy Piper at Madison Square Garden, Steamboat at, a WC at WCW, and Triple H in the Steel Cage match, and Shawn Michaels at WrestleMania. And uh, I think there's special features which has a little more stuff. But anyways, yeah. Um, a lot of great stuff in this DVD. I preferred the original one, the Ultimate Collection, but this DVD was also... Uh, you know, one of my favorites. Just a, definitely a great DVD to get um, if you don't have it if you're in your collection. You know, if you want to start collecting like me, then you should definitely get this DVD. Um, you know, I know a lot of people who have this DVD and they just love it. They always watch it, and you know, you should be one of those guys. Um, you know, a lot of great stories, a lot of great footages uh, of his matches. Um, you get to learn a lot about Ric Flair in this DVD. However, like I said, I prefer the original one. So yeah, the Ric Flair Definitive Collection DVD, very good DVD. However, out of 10 stars, I voted like around 7.5 stars out of 10. It was a great DVD, but I preferred the original one. Very good. Alright, now, next is from irockinoy91. His link will also be in the description box, so go sub subscribe to him. Uh, his DVD request was... The one, the most recent one, and it's Randy Orton, The Evolution of a Predator. 
Um, I'm really happy he requested me to make this video. Thank you so much, I Rock Noy, my good friend. Um, I believe he's a Randy Orton fan, so... And he hasn't got this DVD. And I have to say, buddy, you have to get this DVD. This is a tremendous DVD. Uh, probably my top 20 list because you get to learn so much. You get to see from his eyes, like, what he's going through, like, his career and everything like that. It's just so amazing. Uh, I enjoyed it so much. And, uh, anyways, on the front cover, like I said in my pickup, it's a rugged, uh, cover. You know, it's not straight. Uh, it's actually kind of like 3D-ish. Not 3D completely, but like, you know what I'm saying. And on the back, you get a good picture of Randy Orton doing his pose. Alright, um, when you open it up, you got some pictures. Uh, you got a picture of this hardcore match at Backlash with Mick Fo Foley. A classic match. You got him with a World Heavyweight title. And you got him choking Cena with a candlestick. And here's Randy Orton. Alright, you open it up, you see three discs, so, yeah, and they show some of his, you know, some information, you know, um, when he was a kid, he, he was kind of immature, you know, kid that no one really liked, um, he was bullied in high school, and he went to the military, escaped from the military because he didn't like it, then got troubled, or had got punished for that, and then, um, you know, then he started going to OVW, training there to become a WWE superstar, and he eventually gets there in 2002, April. Um, so yeah, and they also show some good footages of like him in the Evolution era. You know, where he was with Triple H, Batista, Ric Flair. Great stuff. Just a great stuff. Um, and the one thing I didn't really, I I actually was shocked about was when they were keep saying that. The new Randy Orton was a lot better than the old one because the new one was just, you know, he he kept destroying his character with the stupid stuff he used to do. And, like, you know, all the, all the, like, board members or, like, you know, all the legends and superstars of today used to say that, oh, Randy Orton was just a dick and he was just an asshole back in the days. However, now he got more mature and, you know... He's doing his job right and everything and all that crap they could say. And I'm actually very shocked. Um, you know, they also talk about Randy Orton's struggle in the business and his his triumph. And, um, you know, his, he acknowledges his children, his daughter, Alana, and his wife. Um, yeah. So I think it was a very good DVD. A great, this is actually the first ever Randy Orton DVD ever made in the WWE. And that's very sad. But for this to be a first ever Randy Orton DVD is amazing, very impressive. They worked really hard to make the DVD. Um, you know, I liked it so much. I don't know if everyone else liked it that much, but um, I believe someone commented that this DVD was very good. So I'm glad he liked it as well. Um, also, match-wise, there are a lot of great matches. Like, um, you know, Randy Orton's match with Hulk Hogan at SummerSlam was okay. However, you got some matches with. Um, Bob Holly at SmackDown. I think that was his debut match. And then his match with Rob Van Dam and Armageddon for the IC title. That was his first ever title. Don't forget the hardcore match at Backlash versus Mick Foley. Uh, what else? His match with Dusty Rhodes at, at the Great American Bash. A lot of people forgot about that. His Vengeance match with Kurt Angle. Um, WrestleMania 24 match with Triple H and Cena. And it ends up with... Randy Orton facing Christian for the world title. And I thought that was a perfect way to end this. Um, so yeah, that's basically my DVD review on Randy Orton's DVD. Um, a lot of good matches. Actually, a lot of perfect matches that I would put. The one thing I, sh I wish they could have add was his match with him and Chris Benoit at SummerSlam. I think that was his best match, no doubt. Uh, sadly, they couldn't put it because, you know, the conspiracy. No, I'm just joking. No, but uh, seriously, they cannot put it, so that's really sad. But anyways, um, they put other matches that I wanted them to see, uh, especially the Mick Foley and Rob Van Dam ones. Those were the good matches that I wanted to see. Um, so yeah, that's basically it. Um, great DVD, great matches, great stories, you know, you name it. Out of 10 stars, I would give this um, around, around 7 stars out of 10. I think they could have done a little bit more. I mean, when I was watching this part, 
Um, it ended too quickly for me. I don't know. When I when it finished, I was like, that's it? I mean, I wanted to know a little bit more. But, um, you know, what else can you ask for? This was impressive. But I gotta say, 7 out of 10 stars will be perfect for this one. Um, yeah, I think. I don't know. But, um, and this definitive collection was probably like around 7.5 stars. So, uh, yeah, that's basically my DVD review on... Evolution of the Predator Rain Your DVD and the Definitive Collection of Rick Flair DVD. I hope you guys enjoyed it and I hope those two guys enjoyed it as well. Their link will be in the description box so go subscribe to them. There will be way more DVD reviews uh, to be watched or, uh, over the next couple of days on my wrestling channel and my horror channel. All right? Subscribe to me, subscribe to my horror channel and subscribe to these two guys. Well not these two guys but the, the you know what I'm saying. The guys who requested for this. Alright, their link will be in the description box right down there. That's all for now guys, see you guys next time, peace.